Mets outfielder and minor league manager Gabe Kapler is having. Last year, Kapler was a skipper of the Red Sox single A Greenville team. This year, he's a major cog in the Milwaukee Brewers offensive machine. Well, the Red Sox will be seeing Kapler and the Brew Crew this weekend when interleague play begins. Here at number eight, let's get reacquainted with a former fan favorite. Kapler over Pujols into right center and a game winner. The Brewers win it in the bottom of the 12th. I just found out that uh, I missed it. I just missed the competition, putting the spikes on, uh, digging into the dirt, and having that one-on-one -on -one battle with the pitcher. So without expectation, and without trying to predict the future, I just wanted to make sure that I came back and while well, I still had that passion and that fire to, to compete, to, to throw it all out there one last time. Look out, high and deep to left. Kapler may have one. Bless to the wall. Gabe's always been a favorite of mine. Uh, I acquired him from Detroit when I was a general manager in Texas. and I just love the way Gabe approaches the game. Just his work ethic will rub off on players, but he still has some skills. Um, you know, he's a good outfielder. He knows his role. Um, he's always prepared. He's always ready. Back at the wall, out of here. Two-run homer for Gabe Kapler. And probably stepping away from the game. He might have even learned some things from that. Um, I talked to him and told him, I said, Gabe, you, got, you have too much talent. You need to play the game as long as you can. The managing will always be there later on. In the air to deep left, Gabe Kepler has left the building. Hands down, the most important experience in my baseball career being in Boston, and I wouldn't trade that experience for anything. Obviously, Boston's given me a lot. I've had um, opportunity after opportunity opportunity arise for me just because I played in that city. I developed an incredible relationship with the fans. Um, I developed a, an incredible relationship with the city. Uh, I really got to know the city. I feel like uh, Boston is a home away from home for me. Um, and it, it will always kind of hold that, that special place for me. And the crowd chants, we want Gabe, as uh, he hits his first home run since returning to the game. There's nothing like Fenway Park. There's nothing like stepping on, on the field with those fans right on top of you and, and, and their passion for their game, their, their, the fact that they are into every pitch. They understand what it means when somebody gets a runner over from second to third. They understand the, the value of the sacrifice bunt. They know every player um, on the Red Sox side of the field, including the guys that, that most people don't know. Uh, when I was I'm talking about the 25th, 26th, 27th, 28th guy, and then the guys in the minor leagues. So their knowledge of the game is, is unparalleled and their appreciation for the game is unparalleled. And that energy spills over from the stands onto the field. Welcome back, Gabe Kepler. And how's that?